Hello everybody, Dreamcast UK here from ismuchmore.com and today we are talking about putting new games onto the C64 Mini. So you need the C64 Mini, a USB memory stick, now you want to visit the C64 website, when the page loads you want to click on add to your own games and files, once this page loads here it tells you how to deal with loading other programs to your C64 Mini in the steps. So the first step is preparing the USB, then the second step would be to load in the program itself. So in this video we're going to be loading a game that I originally own, which is the Michael Jackson's Moonwalker for the C64 Mini, as shown in this next picture. There it is, all boxed in mint condition. So once we've downloaded that file we need to then move it onto our memory card. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to unzip this. There we go, so unpack it or unzip it. Then following the guide that's previously mentioned, it says we need to rename the file. So that's what I'm going to do now. There we go, it's been renamed. Now we need to move this onto the USB memory stick. Like so. Once that's moved over, you return to the carousel screen on your C64 Mini. Now you want to put the USB stick into the C64 Mini, like so. So now we're going to basic and then follow the next step to loading other programs. Okay, now that we've completed the first steps of this instructions, which was the preparation, we're now moving on to the second step, which is actually loading the game itself. So we have moved the game over to our memory stick and we've then clicked on basic through the carousel screen. Now we're typing in load followed by uh, space, then a quotation mark, then a dollar sign, and then close quotation mark, then a comma, and then eight, and then you press enter. So I did this by using the joystick button number four to bring out the virtual keyboard. So it's going to search the memory card now, and it's found it, it's ready. So we need to now list the items or the files that appear on this memory card. And there you have it, so it's found all these games. Do apologize for the line zero where it says AWS presents, it should be US Gold. So what you need to type in now is you need to type in load followed by the file name itself, which is quotation mark Moonwalker, then followed by a plus sign and then quotation mark again. As you can see, I'm completing this. Using a joystick to type this, it would be better if you connected a USB keyboard but uh, yeah, I don't know how you could do that with only two USB ports, but we'll see. So that's the file name completed. We need to finish this off by typing in comma, eight, comma, then one. Some programs will load and start automatically, whilst others require you to type in the word run afterwards. This game does require you to type in run. So search for Moonwalker, it's found it and loaded it. We now need to type in run for us to actually play the game itself. A little bit of loading there for you and then the title screen should load up right about now there it is moonwalker the computer game 1989 us gold so there you have it it does work so i followed the two steps which is actually just downloading the game itself renaming it putting it onto a usb memory stick and then loading it through the basic program that appears on the carousel screen with all the other games on the c64 mini so it does work fine i'm going to show you a little bit of the gameplay as well, I'm not going to play through all of it, even though I do want to, but uh, yeah, let's have a quick look at it now. So a little bit more loading, and here's the title screen I've shown you loading level 1, and then uh, you need to press the virtual keyboard to press the spacebar button to allow you to actually continue to play the game itself. And here we go, this is the Commodore 64 version of Michael Jackson's Moonwalker. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the guide that I've done here for you. It's on the website. All the details and instructions are in the description field below. And uh, yeah, I've not tested any other game apart from this, but it works fine with the joystick as well. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to click on that like button, if you want to subscribe to our channel, even leave us a comment in the comments field below on what games you want us to try next on the C64 Mini, we would much appreciate it. So you take care of yourself. All the best. Bye-bye.